Hi. I'm standing at the intersection of uh, eastbound ZZ and Highway 67. There's a little DNR two track that goes down to the Hotel Springs, and I often park here. <clears throat> Anyways, the, the burn was pretty successful through here, pretty good, but I had just cut a whole bunch of stuff that was laying down and it didn't all get lit up, so um, I came out here and piled the last couple times and I had some help one one day for an hour or two with, from the inmates from the Sturdivant Transitional Facility. Their hearts weren't in it, so that was pretty frustrating. So this area was really a tangled mess, tangled mess, and <clears throat> now it's shaping up. I'm gonna I'm gonna pan to the west and south here, so you can get a better idea of where we are. All the aspen are girdled in here, so we'll be monitoring their demise. It's going to be quite a mess to clean up when they start dropping, or, or we um, proactively start taking them down when they die. Must be 50 or 60 trees here at least. where we usually see trout when they're here. Right here, just a little bend in the river. They're often uh, in the shade of that water, that bank of watercress there. But I don't see any today. So this is the old hotel site in here. And uh, I'm going to go up a little bit so you can see the the old foundation stones are right here. And we got this whole hillside piled up. Here's some more of that stone foundation of the hotel and uh, more piles. So just wanted to show you the extent of the, the hillside here that we cleared. So we, we cut this brush in the spring and, and I just wanted to see what the fire would do and um, left, a, didn't, left a lot of stuff to pile so we got it all piled now. And there's a ton of aspen in here that uh, we will be cutting down in a year or two. <laughs> 